Hey guys, Sean here from Fishing for Agro Shop. So this is my first fishing trip of 2018 and uh, I started off with three rods and uh, now I'm down to two because one of the rod, I lost my hook and everything. Something picked it up, ran for it and then got stuck somewhere or whatever happened, I don't know. But when I picked it up, I only got the broken line, nothing else. So I'm fishing for carp today and I'm getting a little bit of nibble. So we'll see how it goes today. Stay tuned. Alright, fish on. Doesn't feel big, probably small one. Yeah, a tiny baby carp. Alright guys, check this out. First fish of 2018. Not too bad, huh? Oh, 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 oh! No, 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 You got it. He's not so happy. <laughs> A beautiful baby carp. Alright, time for him to go. All right, guys, at least I caught one fish. Uh, so, you know, no skunk today. I don't know if you saw that, but I actually fell. This is a really steep area and uh, slippery a little bit, so my butt hurts <laughs> a little bit, but uh, awesome day so far. Let's see what else we can do. Alrighty, folks, fish number two. All right, check this out. About same size, I'd say. Beautiful carp, isn't it? Look at the coloration. Little bit of orange on the tail. Orange here. And beautiful carp. Look at him. Ooh. All right, time for him to go home. Third fish of the day, guys. About same size. All right. Do you want it? Yeah. I guess they want it, so. All right, here you go. Got it? Yes. All right, you're welcome. Enjoy.
another tiny one. So I'm not expecting anything big today. Uh, the water level was really low. And this is like the high tide, I mean low tide. So I'm not expecting anything over like, you know, a couple ounces. <laughs> All the baby carp. So I'm using ultra draw today. Come on, buddy, come on. Let's go. Even a tiny one, look at the bend. Look at him guys. Look at this. I hope he's okay. He's sick. No oh, good. Yeah. Alright. But still he's beautiful. Buddy, go home. Alright folks, this one seems a little bit feistier. And the water is coming in. So hopefully it's a little bit bigger. Or maybe not. He kind of gave up. He's not fighting that well anymore. Yeah, it's about the same size. Ooh. That's strong. Yeah. Come on. There's so much fun on ultralight rod, guys. It's really <laughs> strange. All right, not too bad, huh? Lovely carp. I would say about a pound or so. All right, time for me to go home. I mean, for him to go home. All right, folks. Half a dozen fish is not too bad, huh? So I use these. Let me show you my bait today. Oh man, it's messed up. What happened here? Alright, here we go. So here's my bait. Deer corn on a hair rig. That's my go-to bait for uh, any carp fishing, anytime. I know a lot of people will use um, boilies. I don't like to use boilies because I catch a lot of catfish, which isn't bad, you know, because in my book, you know, I do a lot of catfishing anyway, so it's not a problem for me. It's just that, you know, sometimes I do target carp and I prefer using deer corn. I still catch catfish with these, but uh, the ratio of uh, catching carp is higher on these than on uh, bell boilies, so, uh, you know. So, you know, I'm going to call it a day now. and. Uh, you know this is a great great way for me to start fishing on 28 in 2018 so you know if today is any indication for this year that's just awesome so we'll see <laughs>